All the first come up was a blacksmith with a hammer and anvil in his hand. He said he'd hammer a new foundation in Marine from Gipper's land. He hammered her, he hammered her, until his sides was sick and sore. And after all his labor, she laked in the place where she laked before. Oh, the next come up was a saddler, with a needle and tread all in his hand. He said he'd sow a new foundation in Marine from Gipper's land. He old her, he sowed her until his sides was sick and sore. And after all his labor, she laked in the place where she laked before. Oh, the next come up was a baker with a flour and soda in his hand. He said he'd bake a new foundation in Mary from Gipper's land. He baked her, he roasted her, until his sides were sick and sore. And after all his labor, she laked in the place where she laked before. Oh, the next come up was a tailor, with a cloth and scissors in his hand. He said he'd cut a new foundation in Mary from Gipper's land. He scissored her, he sewed her, until his sides were sick and sore. And after all his labor, she laked in the place where she laked before. And the next come up was a big plowman, with a horse and plow all in his hand. He said he'd plow a new foundation in Mary from Gipper's land. He plowed her, he harrowed her until his sides was sick and sore. And after all his labor, she laked in the place where she laked before. Oh, the next come up was a timber man. With the axe all in his hand, he said he'd axe a new foundation into Mary from Gipper's land. He chopped her, he sawed her, until his sides was sick and sore. And after all his labor, she laked in the place where she laked before. Ah, but now the next come up was a big tinker man, with a southern iron in his hand. He said he'd saw the new foundation in Mary from Gipper's land. He rosined her, he saw that her until his sides was sick and sore. But after all his labor, she never laked in the place where she laked before.